Hi everyone, this is Miss Cowan. This is week 15. Uh, this is problem number three. So this question is talking about, there's a table over here on the right that shows the cost of buying different amounts of turkey. Turkey is usually um, bought by the weight. The total cost is a direct variation of the number of pounds purchased. Find the constant of proportionality and show how you found the answer. Okay, so then write the equation in y equals mx form to represent the situation. So if we're looking at this table, we can look to see um, if I'm working, I'm going to make my table go sideways with the x and then the y. So I have 2 and I have 15. I have 8 and I have 60. And I have 12 and I have 90. So if I work from 15 to 60 on a number line, that means I increased by 45. And if I start at a number line at 2 and I move to 8, that means it increased by 6. So let's do the next change. If I start at 60 and I go to 90, that's an increase of 30. And if I move from 8 to 12, that's an increase of 4. So if I write those two um, proportions, the rate of change is the y over the x. So that means I have 45 divided by 6, and I have 30 divided by 4. And if I actually do that calculation, uh, let's say 45 divided by 6, it goes in uh, 7 times, that's 42, subtract, I get 3. I'm going to put a decimal, bring the decimal straight up. I'm going to add a 0, and I'm going to bring that 0 down. 30 divided by 6 is 5. So the first rate of change is 7.5, and let's see if the second one is the same. I have 30, that's the top number, being divided by 4. So let's say 30 divided by 4 is 7. 7 times 4 is 28. Okay, that's 2 that's left over. The decimal, bring it straight up. Make a 0 there. Bring that down. And 20 divided by 4 is 5. So that is also a rated change of 7.5. So the constant of proportionality, 46 divided by 6, which equals... 30 divided by 4, which actually equals 7.5, which is what we came up with for both of them. And what is the equation? Well, they told us to use y equals mx, where the rate of change is your m. So we get y equals 7.5x, and that's... That's my equation, and this is the constant rate of change. Okay, and that's it for number five. I mean, I'm sorry, that's it for number three.